Hey y'all, today I'm going to do a little tutorial about how to wear and tie your single tie mask. So these are the masks I'm making. These are what's in my shop. They're this style that covers the face. Um, they have a pocket for the filter so you can stuff a filter in there if you want. They also have a bendable nose piece. So I'm just using pipe cleaner. You can get replacements on Amazon. You can get them at any dollar store. Almost every dollar store I know sells these in their craft section. I bought these at the dollar store. Um, it just, to easily to put it in, I always pop my mask the opposite direction, inside out kind of, and you just push it into the channel. Um, the other thing I will say is when you go to wash it, make sure you take out your pipe cleaner. Okay, so I'm gonna put mine in there and then just bend it and you'll adjust when you go to put it on. If you have glasses, you can see it's a little more tricky sometimes to get your mask kind of where you need it, um, but we'll show you how to do this. So the first thing you do when you have the single tie, so it's just a shoelace. Um, it goes over the head and ties around the neck. Um, I do these because they're easy and elastic is hard to find right now and shoelaces were not, so that's why we did it. So, um, and it seems to work really well. I kind of like the style. So you take one hand on the mask and you, you can pinch it in the front if you need to hold it. And you make sure the laces are fairly even, so I'm gonna even it up a little bit so I'm not pulling um, unevenly because it'll be hard to tie. And you grab it in the middle of the top part. Place the one hand here, okay? And you hold your mask in place and you kind of lightly put the string kind of at the crown of your head where you feel like it's gonna be balanced. Then you pull the one string. And then once you have that one pulled, you can pull the other. Now, it won't fit right away when you do that. It's gonna pop forward. That's fine, it's supposed to, because now you adjust here to make sure that it's tight. And then when it feels tight, tie the back. You'll adjust this in after. Okay, so tie the back. Now, this is tricky, because if you have long hair like me, you, get, you catch those little baby hairs in there. It's gonna happen. Now that it's tied, you can adjust, okay? Adjust the top, bend your nose piece, and then if you need to, if it feels like it's tight on the side, you can just pull the side part open. Um, there we go. Um, what you wanna make sure is that when you talk, it doesn't go like this. That's because you're wearing it in the wrong place, okay? So if you pull it up further on your face, you don't want it too far under your chin because your chin will yank it down, okay? Um, once you get it right, it takes a couple tries to kind of wear it, in the, wear it and get used to how it fits correctly. But now that I'm wearing them all the time, I've got it. And I usually put my glasses kind of up on top of the nose piece because then they don't fog up when I breathe. As you can see, I'm breathing hard and they're not fogging up. A lot of time I, my glasses fog um, with uh, masks. So, but as you can see, when I talk, my mask moves a little. So it's still too far down on my chin. So that's an adjustment in the string. So I'm gonna pull up a little. Right, And so this is what I said, you have to adjust it. And once you kind of get it, you'll get it right the first time every time. Because now that I'm doing it, like I'm so much better at it. So there it is. And now when I'm talking, my face mask doesn't move up and down on my face because I've got it in the right place. You usually want it kind of right at the edge of your chin here. If it's too far under, like I said, every time you move your mouth, your mask goes down. So, and that's it. So it's tied up here. Um, it's not on my ponytail, so you can see it'll stay in place up on the top of your head. And it just ties in the back. Um, this also makes it easy so now you can open it down. So like what I'll do is I'll get this done when I'm driving. I'll get in my car. I'll do this so it's ready. And then I pop it down while I'm driving and I'll just pull down on the, this part. And then when I get to my destination where I need to wear my mask, say I have to go to the post office or the grocery store, then I can just hold the bottom and adjust my string and boom, it's right back to where it was. I don't have to resize it. So that's it. I'm ready to go. Now, when you're done, obviously you could do the same thing. You could just up over your head and leave it and then you know, oh right, that's the right size. Um, you can look on the CDC for recommendations about how long to wear them, when to wash them, um, but that is all up to you. These are not medical grade. Obviously if you buy it from my shop, it is just to try to help protect you some. Um, they recommend, you know, sanitizing your hands before you go to put it on and when you go to take it off sanitize after you touch it because if you've been out you know it may not be clean okay that's it that's how you tie this if you have questions please feel free to dm me send me a message um, i will help as best i can i hope that that was helpful and everybody stay safe bye